Let's take a look at how to install ColorByte profiles into Photoshop for soft proofing. Located in the Applications Image Print folder, you'll see a file called Profile Manager. Let's launch Profile Manager by double clicking it. Once Profile Manager comes up, it's going to ask us if we want to connect to our profile site. If you need to download new profiles to be used for soft proofing and printing within Image Print, you'll say yes here. If they're already installed, you can say no. Now what I want to do is select the profiles I want to use for soft proofing, and I'm on a 3880 here, so I'm going to select all of these profiles and go up to the File, Install Selected Local Profiles for, Pro for Photoshop soft proofing, select that, and it's going to confirm that it successfully copied all of those profiles to the proper folder. You can say OK, and now we can quit Profile Manager. Let's launch Photoshop and see how we use those profiles. Under the View menu, we can go to Proof Setup and Custom. We want to go down to the Device to Simulate and choose the profile we want there. Now here's the profiles that we copied, so we can select any one of them now. We can also then select the Rendering Intent and if we want black point compensation on or off. I like to leave that on. Say OK. And now you're looking at a soft proof. If you want to toggle on and off, if we look at the proof colors, the command Y will toggle this selection. So let's go back in and do a command Y. And now we can see the difference between the soft proof and the raw image you can see that they're pretty accurate to one another. And that's how you soft proof in Photoshop.